morning guys welcome why is my hair always looking so weird lately good morning guys welcome to today's video today is saturday and we're finally gonna get out there and enjoy this sun that we have it's sunny and we are gonna do something fun before we go sophie has something she wants to try out sophie tell them the plan okay so i'm going to be getting my dog ready for a walk don't worry she can't hear me she's, she's deaf um and then pretending to forget about her okay. and i'm gonna bring the other two dogs that's mean. Don't you think that's mean? I said pretend to forget about it. Oh no, she's gonna be so sad. Is this how I play her harness on? Because she is not. She doesn't stand still for me. Is this a dog toy? No, I don't know how that even got downstairs. Alright, so Sophie's getting her ready. Everybody's getting ready to go out, and now she's gonna forget about her. Poor puppy. Bye, Ruby. Forget about me. What happened? Laura, Laura, I'm so sad. They didn't take me. <laughs> Help! I have to get out there. Are they coming back for me? What's happening? Oh, she did a little cry. Anytime, Sophie, come back, poor girl. Oh, she's crying. I've never, she cried. I've never heard her cry before. Now you better take her out there for a little run. Take her out there for a little walk so she doesn't feel sad. It's slippery outside. So, and we're got rocks in my shoe. That was the saddest thing. No, take her out, seriously. Don't worry, she's smelling you. She's like, I know you've been outside. Well, that's a super interesting experiment. Sophie finds all this stuff on TikTok. She's a TikTok girl. If you follow her TikTok, which is Finn and Sophie, I think, you'll see that she is always on TikTok. But anyway, welcome to today. Gabby's getting ready. Sam's getting ready. And I'm going to show you guys something. We got this happening today, you guys. This is actually happening. It is gorgeous out here. We got Sophie, and we got Gabby, and we got Sam. And we're headed to the barn first to get coffee. We're headed to the barn to pick up two of our boys. Can you guys guess what boys we're picking up? Well, I am gonna tell you. Who are you riding, Gabby? Chino. Chino. Who are you riding? Storm doesn't like water. Storm doesn't like water? Storm doesn't like water. <laughs> she says storm doesn't like water. If I had time, I would get a screenshot. If I ride him, I can't get him in the water by myself. Oh yeah, that's true. He doesn't like to go in the water. Wait, we didn't tell him what we're doing yet. Yeah, okay, let's back up. And Chino doesn't really care. You don't think Chino has? Have we ever? Wait, have we ever taken Chino to the water before? Uh, Chino, yeah. We have. Yeah. Like up to his chest, though. Really? When did we take him to the water? We didn't take him to the water. We took him to the trail and had a big. Oh, that's true. A couple of times. Chino doesn't care. That's right. Okay, and who are you riding? Finny. Uh, so you guys saw Storm got adjusted by a massage therapist yesterday and she wants him to have a couple days off so he's gonna have a couple days off um, and uh, we are taking Chino and Finny to the beach definitely taking them to the beach we've been wanting to do this we've only ever done it one time I'm not talking about when we take them swimming that's a whole different place a whole different video today we're taking them to the beach so we can get up on the beach no, we're not doing that. <laughs> I knew that was gonna come. Mom so gets psycho and then he starts <laughs> prancing. And then he, he he just he doesn't stop. Yeah. Well, we're gonna be safe, you guys. We're gonna we're gonna do it in a way that our kids feel comfortable. It just has to be like that. So it's gonna go slow and steady. If you guys remember, we took Stella to the beach before and Stormy Boy when they were our only two horses. Yeah, we did that and it was amazing and fun. And I'm excited to get some footage to update our intro. But yeah, let's go to the beach, you guys. Oh, also we're doing it now before beach season. So that's always been our problem. We don't want it to be too cold out when we go to the beach, like in winter, but we don't want it to, we can't go in beach season, obviously. So we're going now in May before the beach opens and we're gonna ride our horses on the beach. First stop, coffee. You take up too much real estate. I know, I take up too much real estate. 
Oof, it's actually not that cold out. I see a lot of horses sunbathing. Bring out the leather halter. Leather halter, special effect. Oh, did you guys want to? Yeah, oh yeah, they got to brush and stuff. I'll load the trailer while you guys brush. I brought okay. treats too because this is the new thing. They I actually have not been running now that we've been giving them treats every time. All right, so Chino is standing right by the gate. He's like, oh, I saw you drive in. I'm way. waiting here for you. Just fell down a ditch. But look at this guy. He just comes now. You want to go to the beach? You're not going. Wait, here I have some treats for Finn. Got Stormy's blanket off. You good? You good? You stay. So you're staying, my friend. So see how he's got these, his back is taped? It's just because his muscles were so tight and yeah, he feels so much better. Yeah. Wow. Good job. All right, you go back to eating, okay? We'll see you in a little bit. Trust me, you'd rather be here with your friends. We'll be back. Whoa. He fell in the ditch again. I just don't want him to follow me. Is he following me? No. He's like, yeah, okay, it's fine. I don't need you. I would leave their blankets on because it's going to be cold in the trailer. No, it gets, it's hotter in the trailer. Oh, it gets hotter in the trailer? Remember I don't know. Remember in summer it's cool out in the morning and it's really hot in the trailer? What did I miss? Uh, you could hear the static electricity when I took the blanket off him. And then when I tried to touch him with my my pointer finger, um, it shocked my middle finger instead. <laughs> and at her, I can still feel it. Oh my gosh. And now she knows what Daisy felt like when Daisy got shocked. She was just screaming. Just screaming. Okay, so I am going to pack everything up. Look at this. This is where we keep our treats. This is where we keep our carrots. Who do you, who do you think this is? Who do you think does this? Compartmentalizes food. Mm hmm I wonder who that could be. Um, so I'm gonna help load up the trailer. Oh, it's harder than it looks. I think our trailer needs some fixing, you guys. And this one, I'm guessing. We have a lot of stuff here. We should take all this Helmet. stuff home. Helmets. About the ones with covers on. Okay. Do you need a crop? We need to bring a hoof pick with us just in case. Well, we need to bring one just in case he gets, um, there's rocks. Those ready? Yeah, there are rocks on the beach. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Depending how high the water is, there could be even more rocks. He's like, why? Well, I know you have treats. You know what, Finn? I am the eye cleaning person of the world. There you go. Okay, sorry. So you guys might know that he always gets a little bit of eye junk in this one eye. And we had it, uh, the vet cleared it when we first got him. But it just keeps coming back, so we think it's allergies. Ha, huh? ha, huh, Finny. You want to go for a ride on the beach? I already told him. I'm did you tell him, or what did he say? <laughs> Let's do a review here. We got two girths, two halters. We got two saddles, two helmets. Apparently, we have another uh, rain sheet up here that I didn't even know we had. I wonder who that would fit. At the end of every season, when people are selling off their old blankets, I always buy up a whole bunch of used ones. And I always end up with like this purple one, this blue one, and then we just put them into our tack room. And I forget that we have them. And then the new season starts and I have all these blankets that I didn't even know we had or where they came from. All right, let's go. Let's head out. Let's go to the beach, Finny. <laughs> first got them and we were just starting out in our trailering journey and 
We struggled a little, not too much, not like some horses I've seen, but we did struggle a little. And now our horses just hop on that baby. Well, all of them but mine. I wonder if getting on the trailer, like walking on the trailer would be a good uh, walking exercise for Miss Penny to strengthen, to help strengthen her dispensary ligament. All right, we are headed out. We got them on and we're ready to roll. You guys might have missed it, but we bought new tires. All Sam bought all four new tires for the trailer. We thought about upgrading, but we buy the same kind. We buy an aluminum one, but we buy the same kind. So we decided to keep this one another year and we added new tires. So uh, wish us luck. We're headed to the beach. It feels really good to be able to get out and exercise and move around a little and go out in nature. Oh man, it's just so good for the soul. Right, we have arrived at the beach, big boys. These are our beach boys. Yeah, that's where I was thinking you should get on. Or there's a big rock. All right, I'm gonna put on my winter coat because it'd be looking, it'd be feeling cold. All right, good boy, Chino Bambino. All right, so the horses are already clean. Their hooves are picked. All we have to do is just tack, tack them up. I'm cold too. I mean, in the sun, it's glorious. Oh, I love him. He's such a beach boy anyway, like with those blonde, beach blonde hair. So cute. All right, I'm ready. I got my winter coat on. I got treats in my pockets. We got saddle pads on. Here, Sam, do you want me to help you hold? You're gonna love this Chino Bambino. I think this guy's gonna really open up on the beach and really want to fly. You're tapping in. Oh yeah, I'll walk you. She's got her horse ready. Now she's helping to get Sophie's horse ready. So, uh, the road is kind of rocky here. So we might walk in and then I'll help you find a big rock or something. There's big rocks. I was wrong. It's like cement. There's no real rocks here. Climbed right on. You guys, we used to rock. You want to see real quick? You're fine. You want me to walk them for a few minutes? Okay. Is that where I leave it? Okay. He'll be fine. He'll be fine once we get with his friend. Come on. You're okay. The thing is, we can't stop and do pictures. Oh, good boy. Yeah. We got Gabby up too. I'm over here and Gabby is way up there. Like that's how different the size in Sophie and Chino and Finn. Good boy, we're doing it. This is our first, Finn's first adventure of the year. No, I think Finn's been here before. Uh, yeah. yeah. He has. Finn has been here. Oh, Wait, been here. no, you rode Stella before here. Yeah, but I thought Finn was here too. So I remember freaking out and yelling at you. No, that was Stella. This is definitely Stella. How's Chino feel, Gabby? Good. Good. Looks good. That head hanging low. That chill, really relaxed boy. On trail, so. Yeah. He's like, yes, we're getting out. Corona hot, what? All right, well, let's walk then. Let's walk down the beach. You wanna walk? Gabby, come with us. I've been through heartaches, I've been to heaven. I've done my best and my worst, learned my lessons. No matter how hard my life would treat me, I'd always get right back.
do a little ride before Gabby. Like you can get off and then back oh, on. Gabby yeah. Your horse is calming. Does he look like how gorgeous? Yeah, he's getting there. You're pulling tight. No, he's not pulling. He's not even pulling on me. Lone rider down there. They taught me lows are what makes you feel so high. No matter how far my mind would wander, I'd always dare it to go even farther. Cause I got a million reasons to keep holding on. Yeah, I got all that it takes to win and overcome. What I got is just a feeling, but it's so, oh, so strong. It goes on, on and on, on and on. There's something going on. Okay. Come on, Chino. It's time that you made your mind up. Cause lately all it ever does is change. Feels 
like we're only talking, talking. Okay, so we're gonna prank Sam. You guys are gonna pretend Sophie fell off and she hurt her foot really bad. Oh, yeah, you gotta hold me. Okay, we're gonna pretend like he oh, reared. Oh, people up here. Wait. Oh my god, I saw. So oh, you gotta, you're pulling my shirt up. You have to like pretend you're crying. No. Put your head down. I finished crying already. No, you have to pretend like. You have to like limp or something. <laughs> Can honey hold you like that? Okay, wait, we gotta get Finn. Finn reared. Sophie fell right off. Right off his butt onto her bum. It was gorgeous. <laughs> Sucking like a YouTube dad. We're just joking. She didn't fall off. She got off because he was not as happy as. He was, he was stupid. Whoa. Okay, what do you want me to do? I don't know. Let's get this thing on. Gina was a superstar and Finny Boy was a good boy. He did his best. Finn, Finn was nervous, but he was he did a solid. <laughs> he was good. He was okay-ish. Yeah, like nothing bad happened. So if he didn't really fall, we just did a prank on Sam that he reared and she fell off you, his bum. You said it too said, soon. Yeah. Well, you wanted to play it. Happen. Did not happen. Gabby thought he was gonna rear though. No, I knew he was gonna rear. You guys run on the beach. Well, she drew, she rode on the beach. So this guy was a superstar, like Mr. Brave as heck. That's what we should have named him. Don't go in the ditch. Go in the ditch. Whoa. And Finn was brave. He was spooking at everything. You better hold on tight. I mean, that was a lot to spook at though. Like, oh, and was Finn wet. was spooking. The girth was wet, Chino. The water. Or was it the sweat? Is it sweat or just the water? I guess it's the water. water. Good boy. You were such a good boy. Finny, you were a good boy too. Yes, you were. No, he was good. Listen, we took him into the lion's den and he hardly, like, he didn't act so crazy bad. Good job, big guy. Yeah, good well, job, well, big guy. Thing. You, Finn, you, she know you thought he did worse than you expected? Yeah. So did he actually try? Yeah, there's somebody flying a big kite. Oh, I knew he would be good. Did, uh... Yeah. Today, this ca the car that was parked on the side of the road in front of the field saw me playing tug of war with my horse because he wouldn't let go of it like this. And I kept on grabbing more and more and had half of it. So, was it a fun time? Good experience. Was it a fun time? No, my shoe. Oh, one little drop. I think there was actually two. <laughs> All right, back them out. We're going home. We're going home to your hay, to your friends. Right in. That was super fun for me. It was windy and it was cold. The only part of me that was cold at the beach were my hands and my ears. My ears were aching just because of the wind. It was the cold wind. But the rest of me felt amazing. Loved, loved watching Chino down there. Sophie was a little nervous. If Sophie had been like a tiny bit older, I think she would have done better. Finn was not too bad. He did fantastic. He was really scared, but he held it together. He didn't do anything really bad. He just did a little bit of moving back and forth on his feet. Gab Gabby rode him and he went a little sideways down, but he went down and he kind of was checking out the water. Yeah, I'm going Starbucks. Baby steps, right, you guys? Don't you know that you're beautiful?